Welcome back to Forex Professional Trading in Financial Markets. Pennant, Bearish Pennant and Bullish Pennant will be studied in this session. Pennant Pennant is a combination of a flag and a triangle patterns which has a continual manner. It would be mandatory to study sessions on flag and triangle to fully understand pennant pattern details. Pennant has a shaft-like flag pattern, while rectangular shape of a flag is replaced with a triangle shape. Bearish pennant. Bearish pennant shown on the right graph is formed on a downward trend, which may have a level or gradient support and resistance lines. Resistance line never has a downward slope, while a slope of the support line never forms upwards. Bullish pennant. Bullish pennant, shown on the left graph, is formed on an upward trend, which may have a level or a gradient support and resistance lines. Resistance line never has upward slope, while the slope of the support line never forms downwards. H line. Height is the vertical distance between the starting point of a pennant pole to the peak of the first wave on a bullish pennant or the valley of the first wave on a bearish pennant. TP price would be H or H2 higher than the breakout in a bullish type and lower than the breakout point in a bearish model. In a bullish type SL price is lower than the last valley until 61.8% of the Fibonacci level while SL price in a bearish mode is above the last peak until 61.8% of the Fibonacci level. Several examples can be reviewed on MetaTrader 4 for further practice. On a daily time frame of gold chart, a triangle pattern has been formed and the market price is assumed to decline. TP price can be specified by drawing a Fibonacci on the first swing, from its peak to the valley. A trader can draw a pole on the trend, thus a bearish pattern can be formed. TP price around 500 pips can be calculated by relocating the H trend line to the breakout point. If a trader considers a triangle pattern, then TP would be less than the TP amount in a pennant pattern. Pennant patterns are formed regularly on gold symbols. Another pattern on a downward trend, if a trader considers a pennant on this example, then TP would pass H2 pips. On a longer time frame, like a monthly time span, there are numerous pennant patterns. The bullish pattern was formed on an upward trend. A triangle pattern shows us around 2000 pips TP price over the breakout point, while a pennant pattern indicates 3222 pips higher than the breakout spot. Another bullish pennant pattern on an uptrend can be detected. TP price is determined by using H trend line which should be relocated to the breakout point. TP to SL ratio is considerably high on this pattern. For instance, SL price was below the last valley and 61.8% of Fibonacci level. There is another significant level on 50% of Fibonacci level that can be used to specify SL price in this example. That concludes this session. Until next time and another session, take care.